Hi, my name is Rachel Foti. I'm getting a breast augmentation today with the gummy bear implants. I'm going from a 32B to a 32D. After giving birth to my son, my boobs changed significantly and I want to fill them out. So Rachel comes in and she came in asking for the new, more cohesive gummy silicone implants. They're a slightly more cohesive type of silicone. So the advantages for this implant really are that it's supposed to have a little bit lower chance for capsular contracture because of this textured covering. And also, because it's stiffer, it has less rippling. After I have my breast augmentation and going a little bit bigger, I feel like it will just give me a lot more confidence and a lot more self-esteem. I hope to get that perkiness back and that confidence back. So she comes in on surgery day. We discussed again the size options. She wants to be a D cup. Because of the added firmness, the implant are better placed through the crease incision. And there's a certain technique with putting these, in, these implants in. You kind of have to put them in sideways and kind of rotate them in so the point's in the proper direction. So my surgery is coming up and I'm feeling really nervous and really excited. More excited than nervous. I've never been under anesthesia, but I know I'm in the best hands. So we took her to surgery, we did the inframammary incision. We were careful in this case not to make an overly large pocket. Using the sizers, we were able to determine that she'd get a 475cc implant and they were lined up nice and straight. These implants are shaped, so the pocket has to be made to the size of the implant. Normally we kind of make an oversized pocket. But in this case, the pocket shouldn't be too big. The results of my breast augmentation has been really fun going shopping for new clothes and walking around and finding different tops and cute bras that I want to wear eventually. I couldn't be happier. They look natural. They feel good already, even though it's already been two weeks. These are a little different than with the textured implants. You don't really have to massage these as much. You just kind of let them heal. That's the whole idea. Also, with these new implants, the outer shell of the implant is actually textured. So the healing process is a lot quicker. I don't have to massage my breast as much and I don't really have to worry about scar tissue. They probably will drop a little bit, but these textured implants tend not to drop quite as much as the other ones. So everything looks great, everything's healing fine. She has nice shape to the breast. She loves the feel of them. They have a nice kind of firmer feel. They have to look very natural. She lo loves the nice large size that we went for. So, so far everything's healing great. Since my breast augmentation, I've noticed when I look in the mirror now, I feel so much more confident. Before, you know, after breastfeeding, I'm sure a lot of women out there have seen the mommy boobies and you know just to have them filled out and the way my nipples look filled out and the way that my breasts feel filled out and actually lifted I feel so much better about myself and I my silhouette is so much better in the mirror and I have already a lot of confidence even though it's already been two weeks but just me and my bathroom confidence is good enough so far. My experience with Dr. Kim has been great. He's been really sweet and nice, and he's made me feel comfortable in answering all my questions. He's really made me feel that I was in really good hands, which I was, and if I had any other procedure done, it would definitely be Dr. Kim. He definitely gives that vibe of that he knows what he's doing, he's assured of what he's doing, and that makes me feel really, really good.